Check, check, check. Boom. Bada bang, bada boom, bada bang, bum. Boop, boop, da. Is the phone on? Turn the phone on. No text messages, sweet. Phone, phone, come on. How do you turn the phone on, phone? That was cool.
Welcome in to Akron High School. As I'm calling said, bringing you 2A District Tournament Volleyball as the District 2 as the Akron Rams play host for the Holyoke Dragons and the Yuma Indians. This will all be for seeding at the state tournament in just a couple weeks as we're going to have match number one here shortly between the Akron Rams and the Holyoke Dragons. Both, all three of these teams advance through their host side of districts. The Dragons went 2-0, defeating Marino and Wiggins as the Rams defeated Burlington and Ray, and the Yuma Indians come in 2-0 as they defeated Sedgwick County and Haxton. So all three of these teams coming here as champions of that little tournament that they had is they'll be four seeding the one, two, and three seed of that side on 2A or how they will be portrayed in the state tournament in the 2A side. That taking place in the 9th and 10th at the Denver Coliseum in Denver for the host state volleyball all the time. It's, it's really nice to see. It's always fun to go there for state volleyball. All this can be seen on coloradopreps.tv as the, we get ready for match number one between the Akron Rams and the Holyoke Dragons. I'm Cole Hansted on this big time small town media production. Northeastern Colorado, you need to get in touch with Rick at Glossing Construction, located at 801 East 4th Street in Akron. If Rick can't build it, no one can. Call 970-345-2087. From start to finish, trust Glossing Construction as your one-stop shop for construction. Call 970-345-2087. One of the benefits of being a Premier Farm Credit borrower is having the opportunity one of the benefits of being a Premier Farm Credit borrower is having the opportunity to share in the association's profits. 
since 2001, Premier has paid out over $26 million in patronage dividends. Call us if you want to be part of a local, member-owned and controlled cooperative that understands agriculture. We offer interest rates competitive in the marketplace, and our board of directors is committed to a patronage dividend program. Premier Farm Credit, the gold standard in ag lending. Play sports take planning. Our day-to-day -day lives take planning, but we're not all prepared to plan for all aspects of our lives. That's why we have to rely on people like Joel Nelson at Nelson Financial to help us plan for our retirement. Plan and invest in your best interest without compromise at Nelson Financial, the only certified financial planner in the area. Joel can't help you out unless you call 970-521-7800. Nelson Financial, better to plan and not need it than need it and have not planned. Welcome back into Akron High School as the Akron Rams play host to the Holyoke Dragons as we get ready for this Class 2A District 2 volleyball matchup as the Rams and Dragons will start off and there's actually the national anthem being played as we'll take a quick break here on this big time small town media production. That was the national anthem as we get ready for this matchup. And I was, I was, I told wrong, and I apologize. And this is for seeding at regionals. Winner, host, third place goes to the host, and second place will be on the road. As we will go over the starters for both teams. Starters brought to you by Bob Ollendor and Daryl McCormick. Get to know quack about Affleck if you're hurt or sick. Call 522-2309. First for the visiting Holyoke Dragons, it will be the libero number five, Tia Huffman. Number six, Molly Brandt. Number 10, Jacinda Kruger. Number 11, Aaron Wieselmeyer. Number 16, Ashley Humphreys. And number 25, Lindsey Helgoth. And now for the host Akron Rams, as they will have Number six, Megan Woods. Number 10, Allison Vasquez. Number, that was number 10. Number 11, Sydney Merrill. Number 12, Carly Christensen. Number 22, Jordan Bear. And number 25, Sydney Glosson. That is your starting lineup as we will get ready to go underway here at Akron High School. Dragons defeating Marino and Holio, or excuse me, Marino and Wiggins to get here. The Akron's, the Akron Rams defeating 
Ray and Burlington. As teams will shake hands at the net, we are under, we're going to get this one underway. The Dragons will be in road green with a yellow libero. And the Rams will be in blue with a red libero. If the libero happens to come out. Because I've been told that certain teams don't run the libero, but hey, it happens. All this can be seen on ColoradoPreps.tv. As the officials come near side, check it with everything, do their little have fun. Bear with us, it will be far side. It will be for Kruger. It will go off the tip and down for a kill. Makes it 1-0 to zero in favor of the Dragons. Serve will go over to the Dragons. As it will be just Cindy Kruger with the serve. Kruger's serve will be picked up near side by Glosson. Set up in the middle. It Will be Merrill as you go back row attack, dug out and out by the Dragons. Gives the Rams the serve. Back to serve will be Megan Woods. Woods with the serve will be picked up back row by Wieselmeyer. Will be tipped up over by the Rams, tipped on across, and a free ball over by the Dragons. Set up far side. Will be Merrill, big swing, catches the back line. Megan Woods will serve again. I mean, far side will be tipped up and played by Merrill. A free ball into the net by the Rams. Makes it 2-2. Two to two. Going back to serve will be Maddie King as King dug out back row by Bear. He tipped across on a free ball. King set up far side and it will be Humphreys goes off the block and gets it to fall on the Rams side, makes it three to two. Holyoke leads. Far side will be King with the serve. She'll just miss the net, dug out and a free ball over. Near side will be for Humphreys and in the net will go the Rams and give the point back over to Holyoke. Four to two. King with the serve, will be picked up by Vasco. The near side will be tipped over by Merrill, and be dug out by the Dragons, and a free ball tip over. Near side, it will be Glosson, big dig out by Wieselmeyer, hits into the rafters and falls out, as that will be a kill for Sidney Merrill. Back to serve will be Merrill. As her serve will be picked up, back row and out from King. And evens this up at four apiece here in set number one of this Class 2A District 2 volleyball. Between the Akron Rams and the Holyoke Dragons as Merrill will put one back row for Wieselmeyer. Set up near side, Brandt, big swing, tipped off the block and be dug out back row by Bear. Suit far side, Vasquez be dug out on the big swing by King and the return on the pass. Too close to the net, and Molly Brandt cannot handle it. Makes it five to four. Akron with the lead. 
And it'll be Merrill with a big serve. It'll be back row picked up by Wieselmeyer, tipped up by Humphreys, and a free ball over by the Dragon. Shoot in the middle. It'll be Glossin, big swing down and in. Sydney Glossin gets the kill there. And the Rams have gone on a 4 0 run. Big serve back row be picked up by King and a free ball over by Wieselmeyer be tipped up by Bear. Set, shoot far side, basket is big swing down in past the block and in front of Kruger makes it seven to four. Merrill with the serve once again be picked up by Wieselmeyer, set up Humphreys in the middle It'll be blocked at the net, and Allison Vasquez, Allie, and Sydney Glosson with the stuff block at the net. Makes it eight to four, and Merrill still with the serve. Picked up near side by Wieselmeyer. It'll be a back row attack from King, tipped at the net, dug out by the Rams, shoot far side. It'll be Merrill, back row attack, tipped off the net, dug out by King, and Blocked back down. Actually, they will say Vasquez of the Rams went into the net. And Ashley Humphreys will have the serve for the Dragons. 8-5, Dragons trail. Humphreys' serve will go wide left and out. Makes it 9-5. And give the serve to Sidney Glosson. Glossin with the serve will be picked up by Wieselmeyer near side. Humphreys shoot set for Wieselmeyer. Blocked at the net. Chicken winged out of the net. And shot over by Vasquez. And she just misses the back line. Makes it 9-6. Going back to serve will be Lindsay Helgoth. Helgoth's serve will be an ace down the near side line. Makes it 9-7. And Helgoth will have another chance at it. 9-7, the Akron Rams lead over the Holyoke Dragons. I'm Kwanzaa bringing you Class 2A, District 2 Volleyball. As the serve from Helgoth is long and out. And back in is Huffman to play defense. Back to serve, Carly Christensen for the Akron Rams. A serve from Christian clips the net court off of Brant and an ace for Christensen. Makes it 11-7. Christensen once again floats one over, be picked up by Humphreys. Be put back down by Bear on the return, and no one can dig it out for. The Dragons, and a timeout will be taken by the Holyoke Dragons. This shows how much the Akron Rams have dominated this area as they have gone up 12-7 on the Holyoke Dragons. They have rolled teams all of late last year. Only two losses last year, or excuse me, three losses last year for the Akron Rams as the defending state runners-up. One of those losses was to 1A Weldon Valley, and their other loss came in the state finals. So this team is on a mission to go out and dominate everyone as they really had a good chance last year to win state. And this shows a lot. For the Dragons, they have kind of come out flat and haven't had that spark to get them going. Whereas the Rams have had big kills from Vasquez and from Christensen. As Carly Christensen with the serve will be dug out back row and a lift call on the Dragons. And an ace for Carly Christensen. Christensen with the serve again. And we picked up back row by King. Set near side. It'll be for Kruger. Tipped over the net. And it will be 
Megan Woods in the net for the Rams. And going back to serve will be Molly Brandt for the Dragons, 13-8. Brandt with the serve will be dug out back row by Woods. Set up Christensen, far side, bear, big swing and wide right. Makes it 13-9 as Wood, Woods had a good dig coming forward and then it will be Brandt with the serve. Be dug out back row, set up far side, bear, big swing over the block, be tipped up by Humphreys, a free ball attack over by King, set up, shoot far side, Vasquez down the line and in. Allie Vasquez had to check herself so she didn't go into the net, she had to stutter step. As Vasquez will have his serve, 14-9, be picked up back row by Huffman, set up Humphreys, Kruger with a free ball over, picked up by Woods. Bear with a big swing off the block and still catches the back line. 15-9, and serve will still go to Vasquez. Vasquez with the floater over and an ace for Alley. 16-9 here in set number one between the Akron Rams and the Holyoke Dragons. I'm Colin said on this Big time small town medium production of 2A District 2 Volleyball as the serve comes near side, picked up near for King. And her attack will go long and out. Makes it 17-9. This is the kind of run the Rams are very used to. As a short floater, it'll be picked up and back over onto the Rams side. Set up for Merrill. She'll go tip at the block and get it past a diving Tia Hoffman makes it 18-9. Vasquez with the serve and it'll be too long and out. 18-10, eight point lead for the Rams. As it'll be Aaron Wieselmeyer for the Dragons. And we picked up by Merrill. Set far side will be tipped across over by Vasquez. He's set near side for King. Big swing blocked at the net, dug out by Huffman, and a free ball over by Humphreys, and it'll go long and out. Makes it 19-10. Back to serve, Jordan Bear for the Akron Rams as the Rams lead 19-10, make it 19-11 as her serve right into the net. First service error in short service error for either team. As it will be back-to-back -back service errors into the net as Justina Kruger hits one in. It will be Megan Woods serving for the Rams, 28 to 11. Her serve goes back row, picked up by Wieselmeyer, set up far side for King, blocked at the net and stuffed back down. Sydney Glosson puts it down off the King Attack, 10 point lead for the Rams, 21-11. Dug out back row by Wieselmeyer, set up near side. It will be for Helgoth and be dug out by Vasquez, set far side. Merrill through the block and out. Makes it 22-11. Here in set number one as serve from Woods. Be picked up by Brant, a free ball over and be tipped back over by Woods, a joust at the net and out off of Molly Brandt. And it'll be a timeout taken by the Holyoke Dragons. They trail 23 to 11. Timeouts brought to you by your AFLAC representatives, Daryl McCormick and Bob Mollendor. Get to know quack about AFLAC before you are hurt or get sick, call 970-522-2309. Rams going up big here in the first set. And you expect to see this happen with most teams that Akron plays because they do have that firepower. On the Holyoke side, they're just trying to hang right now and say, okay, let's figure out what we need to do and attack it that way because 
there is some fire on this Holyoke team. They just need to exploit it. Coming out of the timeout, the Rams will have the serve. And it'll be 23-11, served by one. It's picked up near side. Helgoth will be tipped up for Helgoth. Big swing will be dug out back row and be a free ball over by the Ram. It'll be tipped at the net and down as Sydney Glosson gets the point and it is set point for the Akron Rams. Megan Woods will serve for the set. We be picked up back row by Brant, set up far side King, floats over the block. The shot over by Ali Vasquez. It'll be a return attack, dug out by Bear and tipped over by Glosson. Set up near side will be Helgoth. It'll be rolls the net court, dug out by Ma by Merrill before Glosson on the attack and her attack goes long and the Rams give away a set point but it'll still be a set point 24-12 as it'll be Maddie King with the serve. King serve picked up back row by Vasquez near side will be for Merrill pounds one off the block and over onto the Rams side dug out by Vasquez into the net Dug out Glosson and a lift called on the Rams. 24-13 will be King with an ace in front of Jordan Bear and back to a 10 point lead. As four set points staved off and a service error wide and out as King will give the first set to Akron 25-14 here in this Class 2A District 2 tournament. I'm Cole Hansen on this Big Time Small Town Media production. Big Tex, a name you can trust to build great trailers. Big Tex, the name behind quality, precise design, and depth of production line. Big Tex, where style does not get lost in the rugged construction of products. Big Tex, made to last, made to perform. Big Tex, with years of experience and Texas pride built into every product. When your Big Tex touches the ground, it's tested and warranted, ready to transport the job you have. Get your Big Tex trailer at Sterling Trailers. Call 522-2855. YW Electric Association of Akron is your touchstone energy cooperative with rebate programs on energy efficient appliances, water heaters, and more. 2012 and 2013 were your years to upgrade your home. Log on to ywelectric.coop for available rebates. Sending all Washington and Yuma County student athletes good luck from YW Electric Association. Tune in to Kane and see 100.9, 104.7 King FM, or log on to coloradopreps.tv and help YW Electric cheer on your local team. Akron Auto is proud to be the best pre-owned automobile dealership in northeastern Colorado. Quickly expanding, Akron Auto has two locations. The original on Highway 34 in Akron and a second on Highway 34 in Fort Morgan. Akron Auto wishes to thank local patrons for making their business possible and ask visitors to stop in and see what may be on the lot for you. Tax time is the perfect time to use your rebate on a car, truck, or SUV upgrade. Akron Auto, better for your budget. The entire staff of the Washington County Clinic is proud of all area athletes working toward a state title. Commitment, perseverance, and good attitude are all qualities these young men and women have to help make their dreams become reality. Call Washington County Clinic 345-2262 to see how Washington County Clinic can meet your medical needs. Washington County Clinic, dedicated to community health and happiness. The first. Coming out of the set after set number one that Akron wins, the Dragons of Holyoke will have the serve. And it'll be into the hands of Aaron Wieselmeyer. And Wieselmeyer will pit it back row for Vasquez into the net on the pass. It'll be put back over by Kruger off the tip and out. And the first point of set number one goes to the, or excuse me, set number two goes to the Dragons. Wieselmeyer with the serve, picked up back row by Vasquez, near set for Merrill, blocked at the net and down on the dragon side as Sydney Merrill pounds one through and give the serve back to Jordan Bear. Bear with the serve, goes back row, be picked up by Huffman and a rotation violation on the 
Rams give the point to the Dragons. Helgoth coming back in to play front row for Holyoke as Jacinda Crowder, or excuse me, Jacinda Kruger back to serve and be picked up back row by Bear and a lift on Bear makes it 3-1 Holyoke. Rams took set number one, 25-14. As the serve picked up back row by Bear. Set Woods near side before Glosson goes back row and gets the kill as it was going out on a free ball. And Molly Brandt tries to play it. Megan Woods back to serve, 3-2. Akron trails as it goes back row. Set up near side, it will be for King. Blocked at the net and stuffed back down as it was Sidney Merrill. Back to serve is Woods, picked up by Wieselmeyer, dug out by King, and a back row attack from Wieselmeyer will be dug out by Woods, set Christensen, back row attack from Vasquez, dug out Wieselmeyer, shoot far side for Helgoth, will be dug out by Vasquez, set up Christensen, near side, Merrill, big swing, blocked at the net, and out off of King. 4-3. As Akron takes the lead. Woods with the serve. And we picked up back row by Wieselmeyer. Set Humphreys far side. Helgoth pounds one off a of block. Off of Bear and tipped out. You can give the kill to Helgoth. Back in on the court will be Tia Huffman. And Maddie King will serve for the Dragons. Picked up by Merrill. Back set for Merrill. Far side will be... Blocked at the net, tipped back up by Woods. Set up Merrill once again down the middle, pound off a block, dug out by Huffman, shoot far side. Humphreys, Helgoth will be dug out, back row by Woods, and set across over by Gloss, and Humphreys, shoot set for Brandt, will hit one into the net, and it'll be four hit violation on the Dragons, makes it five to four, as Sidney Merrill goes back to serve. Merrill with the serve will be dug out back row by, Huff, by Huffman. Set up Humphreys near side for Helgoth. It'll be dug out back row. And Bear with a free ball one hand over and too long off the free ball. And ties it up at five. And Ashley Humphreys will go back to serve for the Holyoke Dragons here in set number two. Trailing one set to none to the Akron Rams. And it will be a service error as Humphreys hits it into the net. Sidney Glosson back to serve. Glosson's serve will be an ace in front of Maddie King as she rolls it just over the net and King could not dig it out, 7-5. Glosson with the serve for the Rams. It'll be picked up back row by Wieselmeyer. Set up Humphreys for Wieselmeyer. She'll go long and wide on her attack. Makes it eight to five. Glossen serve. Rolls the net court and be picked up by Wieselmeyer. Set up far side for Wieselmeyer. Big swing dug out by Glossen. One hand, it'll be punched back over by the Rams. Tipped across by Humphreys. And down as Bear comes into her radar and puts it down on the Akron Ram on the gym floor, makes it nine to five. Glossen with the serve and right into the net. As the serve will go back for Lindsay Helgoth of the Holyoke Dragons. Nine six, Akron leads over Holyoke here in set number two. A dugout back row off Woods and it'll be a lift. I'm Kwanza bringing you this big time small town media production of Class 2A District 2 Volleyball for seeding at regionals. Helgoth with the serve. And we picked up back row by Merrill. Set up Christensen for Bear near side, tipped at the net and misplayed at the net by Vasquez. And makes it nine to eight. Helgoth serve. 
Picked up back row by Merrill. Set up Christensen. Near side, Bear, big swing, pounded off the block and tooled. Makes it 10 to 8. Akron and Carly Christensen will go back to serve. Christensen, a sophomore for this Akron Ram team, as it's picked up back row by Humphrey. Shoot set for Kruger and goes cross court long on the attack. 11 to 8 now here in set number two. The serve from Christensen, dug out back row by Humphrey, set up for Kruger, pounds one through a block and gets the tip down. Makes it nine to 11 as Holyoke will have the serve. It will be for Brandt. Her serve back row picked up by Merrill, set near Sark, far side for Vasquez. It'll be dug out by Humphreys. The pass near the bench and Brandt cannot get to it. 12-9 as Ali Vasquez will go back to serve. Vasquez will be near side, will be picked up by King, tipped over by Wieselmeyer and down for a kill. The height of Wieselmeyer really helped there as she just did a little skip up and put it down. 12-10 as Wieselmeyer with the serve picked up Vasquez. Far side shoot for Bear, a cross court attack and too long. 12 to 11 now. Whatever Coach Michelle Wieselmeyer said in the set timeout really helped as the serve will be picked up by Vasco. Shoot set near side for Merrill. She will go through a block and down and in. And Humphreys says, I'm not going to get in the way of it. As Jordan Bear will go back to serve. 13 11, Akron Rams. Bears serve for the Rams will be picked up by Huffman off the rafters and a free ball attempt over and it will be by King. They picked up by Glosson near side for Merrill, tooled off the block of Humphreys and makes it 14 to 11. Another kill for Sidney Merrill. Bear with the serve will be picked up by Huffman, shoot set and it'll be set over by the Dragons in the middle will be for Glosson and she will go into the net on her big attack. Makes it 14 to 12. Held off back into play front row as Huffman will go get a drink. Back to serve is Kruger. 14-12, Holyoke trails. Be dug out back row by Vasquez. Set up in the mi middle for Sidney Merrill. Down and in. Sidney Merrill. On fire, the senior for the Akron Rams. Her and Ali Vasquez have been a key part to this Akron Ram success. As it'll be Woods set up near side, it'll be tipped over by King. A back over try by Helgoth on the free ball, and she will hit under the net. Makes it 16 to 12. Woods goes back to Sir, will be picked up by Brandt, set up far side, it'll be for King, pounded off a block, dug out by Vasquez, shoot and Merrill, pounds one off the Matty King block and still gets it to fall on the far line, makes it 17-12. As Woods still serving for the Akron Rams, she'll serve to Wieselmeyer of the Dragons and an ace on the pass. Makes it 18 to 12, a timeout taken by the Holyoke Dragons at 18-12. Looks at the scoreboard brought to you by your local AFLAC representatives, Bob Mullendor and Daryl McCormick. Before you get hurt or sick, got to know quack about AFLAC, 970-522-2309. Give them a call today. as the Rams really kept it close for a second and have just pulled away here as with the six point lead. The Dragons have been much more successful in this first, in the second set than they were in the first as it'll be Woods with the serve. 
Be picked up back row by Brandt. Set up Humphreys in the middle for King. Blocked and stuffed back down by Sidney Merrill. Merrill. Not sure on the kill total, but she is pretty close to double digits as Woods will roll the net court. And will be tipped up by King. Will be set up for King. Goes cross court down and in. And Maddie King will make it 19-13, and she will give herself the serve. King's serve will be dug out by Vasquez, and her dig will not cross the net inbounds. 19-14, an ace for King. Goes back row for Barron, set up Christensen, far side Merrill, big swing and down for a kill. And I have called Sidney Merrill's name plenty of times, whether it's a block or a kill or great serve, digs out. This girl's doing everything good today. She's doing everything well. As the serve will be dug out back row and tipped back across on the return. It's set up for Glosson. Big swing down in front of Wieselmeyer. Makes it 21-14 as Merrill back to serve again. 21-14. A rotation. As a substitution will come in, it'll be Megan Wieselmeyer in for Lindsay Helgoth. And now Merrill with the serve will be picked up back row by Huffman, set up Humphreys. And before Brandt goes cross court and be dug out by Merrill, set near side, big swing from Allie Vasquez, dug out by Aaron Wieselmeyer and a kill for Allie Vasquez. 22-14. Merrill with the serve. And it'll be dug out by Aaron Wieselmeyer. Too close to the net into the radar of Glossen. And Glossen gets called for back row player playing the ball higher than the net. Back to serve will be Ashley Humphreys. 22-15 as the Akron Rams lead the Holyoke Dragons. Set near side for Vasquez. Stuffed at the net. And it was the Wieselmeyer sisters, Aaron and Megan, with the block. Makes it 22-16. Keeps his six-point lead. And it'll be Humphreys back row picked up by Wood. Shoot far side for Glosson. She will hit it into the net. Makes it 22-17. And Humphreys still with the serve. Humphreys' serve will be an ace in the back corner. Had to check with both line judges as it will be a timeout taken by the Akron Rams. 22-18, the Rams lead over the Holyoke Dragons and leads one set to none. Uncle Lawton said, bringing you 2A District 2 Volleyball for seeding at regionals. Home t or the team that wins this will be the home team. The third place team will go to the host and the second place team will be on the road. It's all interesting. So really, if Holyoke or Yuma become a two seed or the second place team, they're going to go on the road two weeks in a row. Or, well, three weeks in a row if they make it to state as well. As the serve from Humphreys into the net will be an air, makes it 23-18. And back to serve is Glosson. Glosson will float one back row picked up by Manny King, set far side. Humphreys to Wieselmeyer will be dug out by Merrill. Set near side for Valley Vasquez. Pounds one down and in off of Huffman. And it'll be set point for the Akron Rams. Glosson with the serve. 24-18 will be picked up. Back row by Manny King. Set up Humphreys. And a lift call, and that will be set number two as the Akron Rams win 
18 and lead two sets to none. They took set number one, 25-14, and set number two, 25-18, as we'll come back with set number three. I'm Cole Honstead bringing you 2A District 2 Volleyball in this Big Time Small Town Media production. The first Pioneer National Bank in Holyoke is a proud supporter of the Holyoke Dragons, and they wish them great success during the tournament. With the interest rates at an all-time low, it's the best time to visit the friendly staff at First Pioneer National Bank in Holyoke for assistance with your financial needs, including new home or home refinancing loans and farm equipment loans. Call 970-854-2227 or see First Pioneer National Bank in Holyoke for details. Member FDIC, Equal Housing Lender. Good luck, Dragons. With more than 30 years in business, Pro Sports is the only place teams need to go to outfit for this season. A complete supplier of team athletic apparel, teams get their uniforms and equipment at a team discounted price. Outfit your team with Pro Sports, located in downtown Sterling, but a proud supplier to teams from all across Colorado. Pro Sports, offering team discounts. Call now, 970-522-8545 and outfit your team today. Pro Sports, your team source. This broadcast of high school sports is being brought to you courtesy of the Allen Bear Agency of Akron. In times of such economic uncertainty, let Allen Bear and his staff service stability when it comes to your insurance needs. With years of experience serving their community with products in auto, home, and life insurance, the Allen Bear Agency is also available for farm, crop, business, and health insurance as well. Give Allen and his team a call today at 970-345-2310 or stop in to 142 Adams in Akron to see how the Allen Bear Agency can serve you. You're looking for a used car, but you don't really trust those used car dealers. At Ertl Brothers Discount Auto in Sterling, trust is not an issue. At Ertl Brothers Discount Auto, every vehicle is fully inspected before it goes out on the lot, so you don't have to worry about buying that lemon. For your convenience of shopping, Ertl Brothers Discount Auto is available online anytime at ebautos.com. They understand that not everyone works 9 to 5, so they'll even set up private appointments to work with your schedule. Visit Ertl Brothers Discount Auto, Monday through Friday, 8.30 to 5.30, Saturday, 9 to 4. Whether you need an... Akron leads two sets to one as I'm Kwanza bringing you Class 2A District 2 Volleyball and Jordan Bear will have the serve for the Akron Rams. A free ball over by the Holyoke Dragons set up Christensen. Far side, Merrill, big swing, blocked at the net, picked up by Vasquez. A back row attack from Vasquez. Goes back line, be picked up and dug out by Brant and tipped into the net by Wieselmeyer. And the Akron Rams lead one to nothing here in set number three. As the Rams won set number three. One and two, 25-14, 25-18, as Wieselmeyer will pop one over on a free ball. Tipped back down by King and gets it to fall on the line on the pass that was too close to the net. Makes it one-to-one, -one and Aaron Wieselmeyer will have the serve. Wieselmeyer will go back row, be dug out by Bear. It was be in the middle for... Merrill and she pounds one down, makes it tw makes it two to one, and now it'll be Woods with the serve. Woods serve will be picked up by Humphreys. Set. Wieselmeyer will be dug out by King, and the dig will go into the net, and a four hit violation by. Holyoke, 3-1 Akron leads. Woods with the serve will be dug out back row by Huffman. Set up Wieselmeyer. Near side for King as her a free ball, flat foot attack goes long. Makes it 4-1. Megan Woods still with the serve. Serve will be picked up back row by Huffman. Set up by Wieselmeyer for King. King on a big swing will be off of Jordan Bear and into the front row near side. Makes it four to two. As back goes Kruger to serve for the Holyoke Dragons. Kruger's serve will be into the net. That is her second service error into the net this match. One service error 
into the net for the Rams as Sidney Merrill will have the serve. Will be dug out by Huffman and across. It'll be dug in, out by Woods. Back over and it'll be for King. It'll be off a block and falls on the Rams side. Makes it 6-2. to two. As King with the serve again. Picked up back row by Merrill. Christensen will set it over. And we picked up by the Dragons. Big swing from King. Blocked at the net by Vasquez. Makes it 7-2. And Sidney Glosson will go back to serve. Glosson with the serve will be dug out back row by Huffman. Set up Humphreys in the middle. It will be tipped over by Helgoth and out. Now makes it 7-3. They had the they miss scored. It makes it 7-3. And an ace from Sidney Glosson. 8-3. Glosson. Floater back row picked up by Huffman. Set up Humphreys. Tipped over. Blocked at the net by Vasquez. Down and in. And Vasquez gets a stuff block. And a timeout taken by the Holyoke Dragons. They trail by six, nine to three. Timeouts brought to you by your local AFLAC representatives, Bob Molidor and Daryl McCormick. Get, get to know quack about AFLAC when you're hurt or sick. Call 970-522-2309. As the Akron Rams have just gone on a run here against the Dragons of Holyoke as just everything so far has been clicking for the Rams. They've had a couple service errors and that is it. Whereas the Dragons are, have what I'd say a three quarter gear. They have the, think of a circle and take out 25% of it. And they have it go three quarters of the way around and then it skips. And that's where the problem is. They have that three quarters of the gear. As it will be Sydney Glosson coming out of the timeout and she will have an ace through the hands of Helgoth. And coming in it will be Megan Wieselmeyer to sub for her. Sydney Glosson with a 10-3 lead will have the serve and she'll float one back row and be pushed over by Huffman on the return. Shoot far side basket as big swing as it'll be off of Aaron Wieselmeyer into the front row, into the bench of the Dragons. Makes it 11 to three. Ali Vasquez putting on a show as well as Sidney Merrill as Sidney Glosson goes back row for Aaron Wieselmeyer. It'll be dug out and tipped across on a free ball by Humphrey. Set up Christensen in the middle, bear, big swing. You're dug out back row by Wieselmeyer, set near side, and it'll be a lift on Ashley Humphreys. Makes it 12 to three. Nine point lead for the Rams. Glosson with the serve. Be dug out back row by King. Humphreys set for Wieselmeyer and Megan. Be dug out back row, set far side. It'll be for Vasquez, set across. Wieselmeyer set near side for Brandt, dug out by the Rams and be for Merrill backs go attack and she gets it to fall in front of Maddie King. Back to serve Sydney Glosson again. Glosson with the serve will be dug out back row by King sent up Humphreys a back row attack from King off the block and down in front of Sydney Glosson. Makes it 13-4. As Ashley Humphreys will have the serve. Humphreys serve will be back row. Picked up by Glosson. Set far side for Bear. Goes long on her attack. Set up in the middle for Megan Wieselmeyer. And she will hit it into the net. Makes it 14-4. And Carly Christensen will go back to serve for the Akron Rams. 14-4 Rams lead over the Holyoke Dragons. And this 2A 
District 2 tournament, and Wieselmeyer will pound one off a block, be dug out by Ali Vasquez, set up for Vasquez, far side, and down on the back line, and Ali Vasquez has close to double-digit kills here in three sets. Sidney Merrill very close as well. And we dug out back row by King. It'll be set up Christensen. Set Woods far side. Vasquez will float one over the block and everybody was standing around the campfire making s'mores, roasting weenies. 16-4 with Vasquez on the kill as Christensen will have an ace through the hands of Aaron Wieselmeyer. Makes it 17-4. Christensen will go back row, picked up by King, set up Aaron Wieselmeyer, and she will hit into the net, and a four-hit violation on the Dragons, 18-4. 14-point lead for the Rams. Christensen's serve will go into the net, only a second error into the net by the Rams on their serve. And that'll give the serve to Megan Wieselmeyer. Eighteen five. Megan Wieselmeyer picked up back row by Sydney Merrill. Christensen set near side. Vasquez goes back line over the block. Nineteen five. And it will give Ali Vasquez the serve. Vasquez will go ace down the far line. Had to check both line judges. It's at that angle that I could see one side, but I got to look at the other. And the second timeout taken by the Lady Dragons of Holyoke as they trail 20 to 5. I'm Cole Onstead on this big time small town media production of Class 2A District 2 tournament seeding for regionals. Winner, host, third place comes to the host. Second place, you got to hit the road. And I don't mean you got to go home. I mean, you got to get the heck up out of here and you got to go somewhere else to go to your region. As the Rams coming out of the timeout real quick, got a, got a quick score of water and 20 to 5. Going in, coming out of the timeout, it'll be Ali Vasquez with the serve for the Rams coming out of that timeout. As Vasquez will float one over and it'll be dug out by Humphreys and set back over Christensen for Merrill and she will have to punch it over. Be dug out Humphreys, set up in the middle for Kruger, blocked at the net and be dug out by the Dragons and a free ball over by Humphreys. He dug out back row, Glosson set far side, Merrill goes onto the hand of King is looked like it could have been out, but she just said, I gotta make sure that it's not going to. Makes it 21-5 as Vasquez will have the serve again. A line drive back row and off of Humphreys and an ace for Ali Vasquez. Twenty-two five Vasquez with the serve will be picked up. Far side King will be set up for Kruger. Her attack is high and wide. Negative Ghost Rider, the pattern is full for Jacina Kruger. Twenty-three five as Vasquez will float one up, dug out by Humphrey, set far side. It will be for Branch. She'll go around a block and gets it to fall near sideline. 23-6, and she will give herself the serve. Coming up after this will be Holyoke and Yuma. As the serve from Brandt will be picked up back row by Vasco, a set near side for Bear, and her attack will go long and out, 23-7. Brant with the serve. A dugout back row 
Set far side will be for Merrill. Pounds one and tools it off the block. Makes it 24-7 as it'll be a match point for the Akron Rams. And going back to serve will be sophomore Jordan Bear. will be dug out near side by King. Set up Wieselmeyer for King. And it will go wide of the line on the attack. Makes it 25-7. And the Akron Rams have swept the Holyoke Dragons three. 25-14, 25-18, and 25-7 as the Holy Oak Dragons will get a break and they will take on the Yuma Indians here in the 2A District 2 Tournament. I'm Cole Hansen on this big time small town media production. Operating loan, real estate mortgage, equipment loan, or need capital for expansion, Premier Farm Credit has the loan products to meet your agricultural financing needs. Loan decisions are made locally by experienced professional lenders who understand agriculture. We invite you to compare your loan to a Premier Farm Credit loan. We're confident that you'll find our products, price, and value to be the best in the marketplace. Call me, Ryan Rasmussen, at 522-2330 for all your ag financing needs. Premier Farm Credit, the gold standard in ag lending. Eisen Oil has been supporting our community for over 65 years and is your leading supplier in propane, Sinclair diesel and gas, Chevron oil sluices and lubricants, and a variety of tires and Delco batteries. Located on Highway 34 in Otis and Platner, Eisen Oil is your number one source for diesel, oil, gas, and propane needs. For all those road trip adventures through northeast Colorado, they offer 24-hour pay-at-the-pump gas and diesel services. Eisen Oil, American product, American quality, affordable prices. Fido has been a staple in eastern Colorado since 1971. Since 1977, Fido has been your place to go for trusses, wall panels, and buildings. With state-of-the-art equipment allowing Fido to stay on top of the truss industry, Fido wants you to know that while the economy has affected everybody, it's allowed them to provide some different services while being able to maintain their spot as one of the top truss manufacturers in Colorado. Contact Fido Building Components out of Otis at 800-925-3207. That's Fido. Proud to support Eastern Colorado. For certified windshield repair and replacement, you already know to call Smart Parts in Sterling. But what about grill guards, running boards, and other truck accessories, such as VW hitches and 3M clear protective coating for any vehicle? Smart Parts has what you're looking for. Ask about the Vortex system, used for sprayed on truck liners to protect your truck bed from wear and tear while enhancing the beauty of your truck. For these and other services, see Smart Parts at 536th Avenue in Sterling or call 522-5399. In 1916, it is estimated that producing 100 bushels of corn took approximately 35 to 40 hours. Today, it is estimated that producing the same 100 bushels takes less than three. A lot has changed in the last 95 years, but one thing has stayed the same. Farm Credit is still the lender of choice for America's farmers and ranchers. We are passionate about agriculture and are dedicated to serving America in good times and bad. This is Jordan Wilkie in the Yuma Lending Office. Give us a call today to see how we can help you. Premier Farm Credit, the gold standard in ag lending. Get your DVD copies of the adventure scene live online at BigTimeSmallTown.com. Hi, I'm Ben Blecka, owner, founder, and one of the talents of Big Time Small Town Media. Very glad you're enjoying the broadcast we're bringing to you live online. But don't forget, you can have this broadcast whenever and wherever you want with the purchase of the DVD from Big Time Small Town Media. Go to www.BigTimeSmallTown.com. There you can check out all the games that we've got from any past tournaments. We've been doing this for just more than a year, and Big Time Small Town Media is proud to be more than sports we're community one of the most important benefits of being a premier farm credit member borrower is having the opportunity to share in the association's profits since 2001 premier has paid out over 31 million dollars in patronage dividends if you want to be a part of a member owned and controlled cooperative that offers interest rates that are competitive in the marketplace and committed to a patronage dividend program call your local premier farm credit office premier farm credit the gold standard in ag lending the entire staff of the Washington County Clinic is proud of all area athletes working toward a state title. Commitment, perseverance, and good attitude are all qualities these young men and women have to help make their dreams become reality. Call Washington County Clinic 345-2262 to see how Washington County Clinic can meet your medical needs. Washington County Clinic, dedicated to community health and happiness. 
The perfect shop for all your needs is Akron Hardware, located at 107 Main Street in Akron. A proud supporter of the Akron Rams, they now carry Ram gear. From hoodies to seat cushions, you can gear up for game day and show your team spirit. Whether it's hardware, home decor, or any other item you may need, get your way down to Akron Hardware, this one-of-a-kind, not just hardware anymore store. Call Akron Hardware today at 345-6600 or stop in Monday through Saturday. Go Rams! 